Hello everyone. Here's my G1X on guitar multi effects processor. Right. Um, I'm not gonna be reviewing this one. There's tons of reviews and how to use this product on YouTube. But what I'm going to share to you is um, hacks or tricks with this one. Um, so when you buy this, it only comes with a battery but not a power supply. The first hack that I'll be sharing is at the back of this one there's USB uh, where is it here and I got an old USB cable from a digital camera that I don't use anymore so use it here and then plug it I'm using my laptop at the moment plug it in and voila it's working so if I'm just jamming or um, doing some recording using my pedal and then on my laptop I can get a power supply through my laptop right second I got an old HTC um, that one charger then this um, USB lead or cable from a digital camera put it in here in my old HTC charger plug it in and then look working I got an instant power supply all right so done with the power supply sorted you don't have to keep buying batteries for your effects pedal or finding a power supply because you can improvise using a phone charger USB cable as long as, as it's a micro USB digital camera is perfect fit for this one cell phones now it's probably different it's not this right, micro USB right next because this one is a power uh, battery powered effects pedal for AAs what I did was I bought this one from IKEA. A rechargeable rechargeable battery. And then I bought two of these as well from IKEA. Uh, charger. So I got this and then the USB charger. You can charge this one through your laptop again cell phone charger just connect this or this one backstack from Aldi I bought this from Aldi it's mainly for our phones so that when we travel we can charge the iPad our cell phones all at the same time by the way the green one here is a fast charge and then you're left with four normal ones so I connect this charger into this one multi chargers let's assemble it so that you can picture out what I'm doing there you go and then the rechargeable battery from IKEA oh 
almost there just to show to you how this thing works there it is the batteries from IKEA Aldi uh, multi charger that charger from IKEA as well voila you got your 4A batteries you don't keep buying batteries and then I use that during live gigs so that I don't uh, uh, have a problem looking for power uh, supply on the stage or especially when it's an outdoor gig and just use the batteries the last one that I did some of uh, YouTube youtubers already um, that reviewed this product presented it but I'll, I'll, I'll just share it with you the wah pedal you can turn this wah pedal manually by stepping on it but it doesn't say how uh, on the manual so there's a button here I hope you can see it that button but it doesn't turn on when you step on it I don't know if it's a factory defect or they just didn't know that it's not working I mean they didn't test that one they put it there they didn't test it how to do it it's not on the manual anyway I cut that one the blue thing there is a plectrum it's a I cut a thin plectrum super glue it on top so that when you step on the wah pedal there that button is gonna come in contact with the plectrum underneath okay and then I can turn it on and off manually by stepping on the wah pedal I hope you learned something on my um, life hack or tricks with this um, zoom G1X on pedal. See you later.